Agenda items would be for consideration. Um, agenda item 7A is the special assessment rate for 2013. Ms. Blank. Uh, yes, sir. Um, and in January of each year, you set the special assessment rate. This would apply to any special assessments generally for paving or tax ut or utility tax districts. Um, if those are not paid off in the first 90 days, they go to a 10-year installment at the interest rate that is set for that year that they are done. And it's set at 2% above prime. That's currently 3.25, so your rate would be 5.25. And that's the same as last year. Okay. Any questions for Ms. Black? Is there, I think we kind of talked about this last year a little bit. Is there a reason we set it so low? We, it's just always been set at 2% above prime. I believe it's in your ordinance. It, 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 just, it just seems to me that we're going to have to sit on it. There needs to be a... It needs to be high enough that somebody would rather go ahead and pay it than us sit on it forever and ever and ever. I guess you could actually look at that a couple of different ways. Uh, there's some of these... Uh, probably the utility assessments, uh, some of the small paving assessments that actually would help some uh, some folks in the community get the paving done. I know I'm going to back up a few years, but uh, I can recall I utilized that same process when I lived on Harmon and Hickory Drive uh, probably now almost 20 years ago. We utilized that to pave those two roads. We actually paid for them and used the uh, Use the uh, special assessment in order to, you know, to get it financed over 10 years, I believe it was, if I recall. Okay. So I see it, again, as something that's positive. Okay. And, and if it helps us get some roads paved, then, I, then, then I'm all for that. Okay. 